New Toolpath Editor Tools in ZW3D 2014 include Toolpath Trim, Reorder, Relink, Extend, and many more. Take an example. Here is a runner. A few toolpaths are cut into this area, but for a better machining effect, these cuts are not wanted. We can use the Trim function to remove them. Using Polygon Select to define the trim area, middle click to trim the toolpath. After trimming, we can also use the relink function to get a continuous cutting tool path. Set suitable link parameters. Now get the perfect tool path. It's very convenient. Let's see a third feature, tool path extend. Here, the programmer wants the toolpath extended to get an improved machining effect. Select the Extend command to achieve this. Give a distance value, then select OK. Let's go to the next section to see Toolpath Reorder. Firstly, use Solid Verify to check the sequence of the toolpath you can see that the cutting sequence is from right to left. According to machining process, we need to adjust the order from both sides to the middle step by step. Pick the reorder command. Select a toolpath and send it to the bottom one by one. This ensures machining balance throughout the process. Once you're finished, let's use Solid Verify to check the results. The optimized toolpath will produce much improved results. With Toolpath Editor, we can quickly get better toolpaths without adjusting the complex parameters drastically saving recalculation time.